Welcome back to the 67th, 62nd, give it five extra years. It's been here five years. Been five years. I don't think we can take more age, darling. <laughs> <laughs> Live here on Channel 7 with Toma Hopkins, Harry Porterfield, Diane Burns, Rush Ewing, and <laughs> Jim Rose. Rose. Coming down the King Drive now, the uh, Chicago Vocational High School Marching Band. They're showing their fun. All right. <laughs> Go for it. This is, this is a time to demonstrate your best. Believe me, all of these bands, they do. Tom, have you ever seen anything like this? Nothing like you this. Ever, so this we, were, we were sitting here talking about the fact that all communities should have something like this that they can take pride in. It makes such a difference. I would love to see a, a, an outreach program where we could get involved with something like this for our communities around the country. It's wonderful. They'll be calling you. <laughs> <laughs> My phone number is. Call it here, right. And it really is a, a time for families to get together. Oh, yeah. It's great. Everybody dancing on the uh, sidelines and singing the song out loud. You know, one nice thing about uh, this uh, parade, as we've already mentioned, is that at the end of the line, uh, there is food, there's barbecue, barbecue and there's entertainment, and there's uh, beverages and all these sort of things waiting. Listen to them get into it. I know it. I love it. <laughs> you wonder if they have enough energy to sustain themselves until they get all the way far. Oh, I don't do. think they're going to have a problem. Well, they're going to be mighty hungry and thirsty when they get there, I'll tell you. And they're thinking about all the teenagers on the sidelines watching there them, so yeah. I think they'll have the energy. And again, you know, that it just shows the commitment of these young people mm -hmm. uh, to practice, practice, practice during their summer vacation. Where is JR right now? Let's see, let's see what he's doing. JR?